Help for Houston's homeless taking a hit. Organizations and people looking to feed the homeless will be hit with a fine starting tomorrow. That's because of a new ordinance in Houston and a new statewide encampment ban becomes law tomorrow. KPRC2 Sion Rhodes hearing from both supporters and proponents of the move. She's joining us live at City Hall with their reaction today. Sion? And it's really two separate issues, Christine. The group Food Not Bombs has been serving hot meals for free for anyone who needs them here near the main central library downtown for almost for more than 15 years, really. But now because the library will reopen for the first time since the pandemic began, they've been told they've got to go. If you've got people that are hungry, What's more important? Since 2005, Food Not Bombs has provided free meals to those who need them the most. We are out here four nights a week, rain or shine. But now they're in a battle with the city, who they say is forcing them out of their setup at the Central Library because it will reopen soon. And they said that there was concern about the public and the homeless colliding. Food Not Bombs says the city wants to relocate the group to an area near the Central Municipal Courts building on Lubbock Street. We will not be pushed off to some a uh, place where it's convenient for the mayor. Let's revisit this and let's do away with criminalizing the, the feeding of the needy in our community. This fight comes as a new state law banning homeless encampments on public property goes into effect tomorrow. It's a class C misdemeanor and violators could be fined up to $500. We definitely do not believe in criminalizing homelessness. The real solution to homelessness is again not to simply displace people or to um, drive people away, but instead to put people in permanent housing. This is not a criminalization statute. This gives a tool to law enforcement to make sure that we don't have large scale encampments, you know, start up, which inevitably have crime and other problems associated with it. Now, in a statement in response to Food Not Bombs, the mayor's spokesperson said the decision is due to public safety concerns, including the spread of COVID-19, and that the main Houston Public Library, they said, is not a conducive location to continue feeding homeless individuals. The spokesperson going on to say that members of the public, including parents with kids, have expressed reluctance to visit the library because the feeding program draws a big crowd and leaves behind debris. The library, according to the city, is set to reopen here in a couple of weeks. The spokesperson telling me they are still willing to work out some sort of compromise with the group to continue the feedings, but just not at this location. Live downtown, Sion Rhodes, KPRC 2 News.